What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Dust, an Elysian Tale. In the last episode, we were uh, going up through here these, uh, what did I call them, the Cinnabon Caverns? Yeah, we're going through the Cinnabon Caverns here, and uh, I don't know, looking for things. What are we doing down here again? Oh, we're going to go meet with somebody who knows how to stop something. I don't know. Holy shit. Hit of spiders. Get me out of here. Didn't mean for that to happen. Here I was getting hit thinking, oh, no big deal. But then I fell all the way down into a giant a pit of giant spiders, which is great. Okay, apparently we have to go the way I was going. So that's good to know. That's a good thing to know. Hey, more giant spiders. Yay, I love them. They're my favorite. Lucky for them, I can wreck their shit. Because then... Why is it lucky for them, you're wondering? Because that way their death is painless, or at least it's quick and less painful. They're not suffering is the word I'm looking for. That's always a good thing, right? I thought so. Anyway, let's try not to get hit this time. What do you say? You Dumbo, you Dumbo-matic you. Don't get hit. Get ready to slide, mother, slide. That's what we got in the last episode. We got the slide technique. The slide technique's what it's all about. Oh god, not that thing. Get out of here. Uh, poison guys, get out of here, poison guys. <gasps> There's a treasure over there. Oh, okay, we're going back. We're going back. I want that treasure. I know that probably means we're gonna have to go back and- Oh god, fucking godforsaken poison bastards. I'd rather get the treasures down, like, in this kind of place first. Don't get me wrong, I know we're gonna have to go back down and get that- The friend that had a- had a, was in a cage and we needed four key locks to get him. We'll have to go back for him later, or it- Shim, whatever's in the box we'll, or the cage, we'll find out later. I know we'll have to go back for it later, and we will. Oh, we're down here again. Okay, that's fine. Um, but yes, we'll go back for the friend later. We, I'll just try to make sure I take note that the friend is down there in the area where we got the slide technique, pretty much. Um, yeah, because we just used up another key, we definitely don't have four keys now. I didn't even. Did you guys notice how many keys I just had when I opened that chest? Because I did not take note of that. Anyways, on my way downtown, walking fast and faces pass, and I'm homebound. Wondering, I'm wondering why am I singing that song? That's what I'm wondering. Stop singing random songs, Funky. Especially ones that are irrelevant to anything you're doing right now, which is destroying enemies. Wait, can we go over here to the left? No, okay. Dropping down. Dropping a deuce down the hole. That's what we do every day, every day, all day. What are we taking this bomb to blow up? I don't know. Oh, God damn it. I need to stop taking needless damage, man. I really do. I take a lot of needless damage. Falling on spikes, running into enemies. I take a lot of needless damage. Also, what was the point of bringing this bomb with me? What's the point of having two bombs? Is there a purpose? Hold on. What purpose do you serve, bombs? I don't know. I don't know what purpose you serve, bombs. One bomb, I don't know. Yet two bombs, I'm equally... If not more so... <sighs> more so... Ah, yeah! Well... I think I know I know where I need to take them now. Over here somewhere. Why is there two bombs though? Wait, no, this is back where I came. Wait, 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 wait. What the hell? Something's down here. What the fudge? I couldn't go left or right. There's just spikes everywhere. The fuck? Oh, are we just bringing them for extra light? Is that what we're doing? Is that what it is? They're extra light in the darkness. I suppose that's a reasonable use for them, I suppose. But I don't see... There's got to be something to use these for. Down here? I didn't blow up shit. Wait, there is a platform over here to the right, though. Oh, I didn't even... Okay, I missed that platform. Never mind. Okay, I figured it out. Or maybe. Dude, there's bombs everywhere. Are they just used for light? Is that what they're for? I feel like they gotta be used for more than that, but it's very possible that's all they're for. Um, we can get up there. Just gotta use a little bit of my techniques. Alright, what's over here? Ooh, a key, yes. More keys are good, very much so. 
Can we get anything else up here? No, all right. Dropping down. Dropping a deuce down the hole. Ooh, another save point. All right, I'll use it because save points are good. Still at 35%, which is where we were last episode. Um, still don't know if we're going to need the bomb, but you know what? We can use it to our advantage. Screw it. Or not. Okay, there we go. I was about to say, we can use it to our advantage. I know we can. Okay, what was over here first? Before we go that way, what's over here? Spikes. Red stuff. I'm not sure what the red stuff's all about. We can go to the right here. Okay, this is a dead end on the map. So where's this? What, what's over here? Let's see. This is... Seems kind of... What? Um... Okay. That's it? This just seems... Oh, here we go. I was going to say, there's got to be something here, right? Alright, there's got to be a bomb. I mean, a, another platform up here somewhere. Oh, there we go. Oh, without a bomb. We need a bomb to be able to see, man. Guess I'm going to the right. Nope. Oh, wait. Landed on a platform. Going right. Yes, we landed somewhere. But... There's nothing up here. Great. Okay, well, let's try that again, shall we? I can see the annoyance of having, or I mean, I see, God damn it! I didn't mean to launch the bomb so far. You know what? That actually works. Okay, so, damn it. I know I gotta jump over there. Huh. God damn it. Jump, you fool. Damn it, okay. Just use the spin technique. Okay, there we go. At least that way I know I can Fucking oh, it didn't. That didn't blow up. Well, that's good, sir. Okay, there is. Ah, oh, fuck you. Oh, so much fuck you. Like as much fuck you as I can get. About as fuck you as the world will allow. God damn it. It's all right. We know there's a platform over here. Let's get to it. Please tell me we're almost where we need to be. This dark platform bullshit is not uh, not agreeable. Sorry, I'm scratching my head for a second. Not because I'm confused, but because I just need to scratch my head for a second, okay? Just don't, don't fucking judge me. Okay, what am I doing? Okay, I landed on a platform. Thank, thank, thank the heavens. All right, wait, wait. What I just find? I found some Randy Moss, red moss, red moss. Okay, found some red moss, guys. I forgot what that quest was. What? Um. Oh, 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 okay. There was somebody who wanted that shit. Well, I'm glad I found that then. Okay, well. Well, well, well. Something tells me there's probably something on the right side of this area, too. Or the left side. I guess that would be the proper... I don't know. Should I go up higher and see if the right... The, the, the left... Do I know my rights and my lefts? Goddamn. The left side of this area has anything? I guess I could check. Goddamn it. Didn't mean to blow that up. On the positive side, I kind of remember where the platforms are, but not really. Remember, we could go over here like that. But if we want to go up higher and higher. Oh, yeah, there's a treasure. I'm glad I checked. Sweet. Glad I came back to look around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me all your things. Give me all your things. I just pick up a ring. Got five, I just got five Kimbaps. Kimbaps are good. Ring of Sight. All right, we'll have to check out that right now. The Ring of Sight. Uh, we have, what do we have equipped right now? We have a ring of sight and a smooth ring. Oh, I think I just equipped it, actually. I took off one of my dull rings. So, yeah, let's go with that. Or wait. I already had a ring of sight on, huh? And I just got another one. So my luck will go down two, but my attack will go up three. Plus, I'll be able to see more in the dark. I don't think that actually helps. You know what? I might go back to this one. Just for the luck. I don't need the extra three attack. Three, oh, God damn it. Three attack isn't that much, so I'm not going to worry about it. I'm just going to head back to the left of this area, hit up the save point again. Now that we've opened up that area and got that nice little red, got ourselves some red mouse, some red randy mouse, and let's go to the left side now. Whee! 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 Chopping Fulios up! Taking all their sheep. Working on my shit, you know what I'm saying? Iggy Azalea style. All right, we got one bitch down, two bitches down, three bitches down. Heavy lies the crown. Oh, okay, we could go down here. I was a little worried we couldn't go down here. Got him. 
done. You're done, son. You're done. Ooh. Free light chainmail blueprint. I'll take it. Yay. Any reason to have a bomb down here? Probably. We'll find out. Okay. Okay, actually, that was a counterattack. Every time it goes slow motion, I think I got hit super hard. It's usually just a counterattack, which is a good thing. Get wrecked. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Are we... There's nothing down here? Okay, that's just gonna blow up. Um, I'm assuming there's just nothing down here. Otherwise, there'd be platforms. I haven't seen any platforms. Just gonna go left, because that's the only way we can go right now. Unless I come across a wall that I want to be able to blow up that I can't right now, because I don't have a bomb on me anymore. And a dude down here. Ooh, and a note. Wait, that wasn't a note. That was a... Oh, got him. Got him. Wrecked him. Gonna wreck him. Wrecked him. I'm gonna wreck them, you'll wreck them. Do you understand the words? Well, get over it, because that shit is painful. Just making sure I didn't miss a miss a, a, a turn, you know? Don't wanna miss a turn. Don't wanna miss a thing, because otherwise I'll miss you. And I don't wanna miss a thing. Moving on, shall we, to the left. We're almost to the flag. We got one more area to go through, this one gonna wreck the shop until we uh, make that make that money almost level 14 so close I can taste it level 14 nope not quite we're gonna get there oh wait nope I did get there awesome which means I'm gonna use it on Ooh, attack or HP let's go HP again HP is an ongoing problem it really is attack would be nice next time I'll go attack and we're gonna be so strong no enemy will even fucking get near us dare breathe near us for fear that we will cut out its breathing apparatus whatever it may be I was gonna say heart but you know what first of all hearts not for breathe well that's debatable pumping the blood I guess heart technically is part of breathing point is lungs are for breathing we don't know if these creatures have lungs or a heart I'm sure they have something like a lungs or a heart that's why they tick that's why they're alive that's why they're sentient that's why they are things but that being said can't presume that they have heart or lungs like I do. Okay, let's open another goddamn chest, which I also didn't see how many keys I had. Apparently, I still have enough to open that one, so I'm good. Let's get all the things and a ring of apprentice blueprint. Also, no, I did not want to drop down. Not what I wanted to do. Where's the double jump ability that'll let me save myself from falling? Damn it! You know it exists. You know it exists. Or do I? I have no idea. I'm just playfully presuming and hoping and wishing and praying and all the other things that you might do in anticipation that you might be able to do something that you want to do. Die, you fucking she goth bastards. Alright, yeah, either way, we're going down in this area, so I want to check all the lefts and the rights. Gotta make sure we check all the lefts and the rights. Give me all of your kimbaps. Kimbaps are good. Another save spot. Man, the save spots are very liberal in this game. I rather enjoy that. Also, that save point is right before we go to a new screen. Are you prepared for a boss fight? Because I know I am. Wait, not a new screen yet. Okay, now it is. I have a feeling boss fight is imminent. I am here. Yes, you're here to serve. I know. Do I have any new materials for you, sir? Going into cell mode first. Anything new? I do have Trolk shells. You may have one. Because that is all I have, and that is all you require. Nothing else new. We're good then. Let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Alright, so... Oh, here we go. You ready for a boss fight? I know I am. Oh god. She looks friendly, but watch. Who are you? She doesn't even have a mouth. I am Dust, and this is Fidget. We came from mud pots seeking the one they call the Lady. Their springs have dried up, and I'm here to find out why. You would dare enter my domain and question me? Yes, the waters have stopped flowing. I was the one to stop them. Bitch! Be careful, Dust. I do not believe she's used to being spoken to so casually. I meant no disrespect. Uh... I am Lady Tethys, and you will refer to me as such, with the courtesy reserved for all... Wow, what a self-righteous bitch. Okay, Dust, maybe you should dial it back a bit. She's getting pretty ticked off. Lady Tethys, the mud pots need your help. What 
One of them is already close to death, but your healing waters could save his life. You, a surface dweller, would dare to question my actions? Who do you think you are, ordering me to release the waters of life? I would question the motives of any creature, deity or not, that would let their subjects perish without reason. I have felt the endless conflict as my waters ebb and flow through your land, surface dweller. I see this water satisfying the thirst of a creature much like yourself. A killer with a broken soul. A creature like me? You mean... He leads a great army across these lands, spilling innocent blood, and using my waters to give life to his campaign of hatred. I stopped so you water, stopped the water for everyone. So, stop the violence. so you could stop the one evil but you're guy. Punishing innocents and guilty alike. Your own followers in Mudpot will die without that water. If their deaths are required to save this world, that is a sacrifice I am willing to make. You speak in petty terms. A person, a family, a village. Their deaths, same as yours. Are insignificant to the greater good. I don't like the I don't like your words, Daisy. Prepare yourself. Uh oh. She's not happy. Time to throw down as I suspected. I seen where your path ends, Lady Tethys, and I will not let you succumb to the same fate. Too many innocents have died already thanks to Guy's campaign. So be it, service dweller. If you would raise your sword against me. Then prepare to have your accursed soul ripped from your body and purged in these holy waters. Bring it on, bitch! You may have a uh, mean voice, but you ain't got you ain't got the fucking scary face. Well, I mean, the fact that you have no mouth is pretty creepy. Anyway, I'm fucking look at this shit, dude. I am rocking her goddamn socks off. All right, somebody also mentioned to me uh, the other ability that I got for uh, for. Uh, God damn it! For for what's her name? Fidget. God damn it! They said it's she used the R button to use it, but I'm not entirely sure that's how you use it. I'm actually healing myself and, and I'm not even paying attention. Anyway, I fucking whooped her ass. She did not even stand a chance. I feel like I'm probably over leveled, but you know what? Tis the nature of a beat 'em up game. If you beat up everything, you're what? gonna over level. Plus, it's got quests. What have you done? I whooped your ass. Some sense into you, I hope. I can feel the darkness slipping from her soul dust. We have done it. She is now safe. Can you release the waters now? I know you feel like you were doing the right thing by holding back the waters, but Mudpot needs them now more than ever. Oh, the waters, yes. I am okay, so she had some kind of late. corrupt bullshit going on. Indeed. Some evil tried to get her to stop. I feel yeah. I did little to stop All did was hurt everyone, man. Already, I can feel his army's footsteps. They travel north into the mountains. Good, because that's my next destination the Please mountains. Don't hurry. Ginger was on her way there, too. Before you go, perhaps I can repay you for freeing me of my madness. At the base of the northern mountains, there is a grand estate. The baron of these lands is a man named Cain. He knew your general, and if you help him, he will be willing to assist you in your quest to end Gaius's campaign. And how do you know that? And how do you know all that? Because I am attuned to the life thread, my dear. I can sense all life through the waters I send to the surface. Now, more than ever, I can feel the despair that all surface dwellers feel because of your general's hatred. Makes sense. He is not my general. Perhaps not now. But I can see you were once very close to this General Gaius. You can see into my past? Your soul is fragmented, like a shattered mirror. I can only see reflections in the broken pieces. And what I see makes little sense, even to me. Oh, all-powerful, all whatever your name is. powerful forces at work within you, Dust. How a little creature could carry such a shattered soul is beyond my understanding. However, that doesn't matter now. She's right, Dust. If we're going to speak to this Baron guy, we need to get moving. We need to get the f*** out of here. Is Lady Tethys, but we must make haste. There is a villager in Mudpot who is very close to death. I can feel it now. His life force is very weak. How 
could I let this happen? What... what have I done? We've no time to waste. Is there a shortcut back to Mudpot? Yes, of course. Right through here. Though I fear you may already be too late. Of course not. We'll get there in time. Just you wait and see. I hope so, Fidget. Goodbye, Lady Tethys. Goodbye, Dust. And good luck. Super sweet time. Alright, let's get to Mud Pot. I'm sure it doesn't really matter how fast I get there, but I'm going to look around this area for a sec. See if she's got any treasure chests or something lying around. I doubt it. Oh, that was good. That was good. With our brand new full health. Just fucked it up. Just fucked it up. Okay, that's a shortcut. Um, ooh, what's down here? Wait. Which one's the shortcut? The bottom one or the... Uh, this one, I think... Is this a... What is this one? Okay. Um... Okay, that was a shortcut. Hold on. I want to go back again real quick because I want to know what the upper one was now. I thought the lower one was the item. Maybe the upper one's the item? Ah, here it is. She's got a new projectile type. There's the new projectile type you guys were talking about. You said I already had it. Apparently I didn't have it. Oh, you cycle through them. Oh, never mind. You guys were right. I was wrong. I was cycling through them, thinking RB was going to use them. No, RB is to switch hers. I got it now. So now I know how to cycle through her techniques. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I'm glad it taught me that real quick because, honestly, I didn't know that was a thing. Didn't know that was a thing. All right. So we got three fidget abilities now. I'm going to have to start using some of them, maybe, kind of, sort of, hopefully. Um, there must be a wall or something here to blow up because why? Where is this? I don't recall this area. Oh, this. Okay. This is that wall. Alright, I get it. Alright, Cinnabon Caverns, let's do this. Let's go with Christ. Yeah, alright. Get the last sheep. No, I still have one more sheep to go get, correct? Hey, look. Sunlight. Fancy that. Fancy that. A final parting gift from Lady Tethys, it would seem. That'll help when we need to return to the surface. But right now, we should find Bopo. Lady Tethys seems convinced we would arrive too late. We'll get there in time. We have to. We did everything we were supposed to. Indeed. You have much to learn about the world, Fidget. Sometimes, even your best is not enough to avert fate. Come, let us make haste to the village. Sometimes, even your best is the worst thing ever. But in all seriousness, it's not enough. Alright, we need to get back. I gotta go to the screen where I first came into the village. Yeah, I know I'm gonna ignore the guy who's dying. Or am I? Oh, maybe not. Never mind. I was gonna ignore him. But first, let's do this. The water's running. You did it. I was gonna go try and get that we last sheep. Back as soon as we could. Where's your mother? She's inside with Pa. Once the water started flowing again, she brought it right in for him. Oh, look, here she comes now. Mama, look, they're here. Thanks, little I bean kid. Yay. I didn't even notice she was carrying around a baby in her other arm. How did I not notice that? Mama? What is it, Mama? Uh-oh. Are we going to get a sad moment? Please don't be sad. Oh, shit. We were too late. He held on as long as he could, but it just wasn't enough. Huh? Oh, no! You can't go! Just got the water running, he did! I'm sorry, sweetheart. I truly am. He was such a fighter. It was... It was just his time. And when it comes, there ain't nothing you can do. But we got the water running. We... We failed, Fidget. We weren't fast enough. Damn it! We weren't fast enough! Dust, you stop that moaning right this instant! You did what you could. You did more than anyone. And for that, you deserve all our thanks. You could have gotten the water running days ago. But I think the hurt was just too hard on him. Pa, huh? did you hear? I got the water running. Pa! Huh? Pa! Huh? Master, let's give them a moment to love. They can have their moment. That shit is sad. Like, very sad. 
makes me wonder if I could have possibly saved him if I had actually moved quicker. I don't understand. We got the water running. We did everything we were supposed to. Tijit, it's like what Bopo's mother said. When the life thread calls for you, you must go. He was fated to pass, and there is nothing we could have done to stop it. That doesn't excuse this, Aura. Did you know? Did you know we'd be too late? If I told you before, would you still have tried to save him? The village needed its water supply. I would have gone to the lady either way. Then it doesn't matter what I knew. And it is why there is hope for you yet, Dust. What does that mean? Why is it that every time I make a decision, you treat it like some kind of test? What haven't you told me, Ara? This is not the time nor the place. And just what is the perfect time and place? How many more have to die before you tell me who I am? Who am I, Ara? What am I even doing here? Stop yelling! Just please, please stop. I can't take this right now. We did the best we could, Dust. We did the best we could. I'm sorry, Fidget. I didn't mean to... And stop worrying about who you are! You're dust! You hear me? I don't care who you were! I don't even care if you used to work for that general guy! Because you're dust now! Wise words, Fidget. Dust, your past is fractured, and your future has not yet written. But you have traveled through this world as a beacon of good, and that is all that matters. You're both right. I'm worrying so much about who I was that I've been blind to the good I've done as dust. Anyway, it's late. We should find a place to sleep. Should we? I didn't even know that was a thing we had to worry about. It seemed to me we didn't have to worry about sleeping. The game just kind of went on and we just kept going in real time. Anyway, this shit's getting real, man. Sad things happening, people dying. Dust questioning his own existence and what he was, and they're like, No, you are who you are, be who you are now. And we have to go to the funeral. Stop it, man. Stop it. And who have been. We'll be seeing you, old friend. Goodbye, my love. Goodbye, Pa. I'll miss you. Bopo. Thank you, Dust. Without you. We wouldn't have any water. You saved Mud Pot. I only wish I could have done more. Nah, you did plenty. You showed me what it means to be strong, even when the world's against you. Pa's gone now, so I gotta be strong for Mama. Strong like you. You're a good kid, Bopo. I think your father would be proud. I think so, too. I also think he's happy I found a friend like you. Thank you, Dust. I'm sorry, Bopo, but I have to go now. I have to get back to the surface to make sure this doesn't happen ever again. You'll come back, though, right? We gotta make sure you come back. I... I can't. Aww. I promise. Just make the promise. Whether you actually come back or not is irrelevant. As long as he thinks you are going to, hope will be there forever. Are you okay, Bopo? Is there anything I can do? It just doesn't seem real. Pa's gone and I wish... What is it? Well, I wish I could give him a proper send-off, you know? My whole life he'd been telling me about visiting those snowy mountains on the surface. And now he'll never get to see it. Not unless I help him. Just, do you think, somehow, you can try and get me some snow? I think Pa would really appreciate it. Of course, Popo. I understand. When I'm in the mountains, I'll remember to bring you back some snow. Promise. Thank you, Dust. Oh, thanks so much. What a weird what quest. Did you say, Dust? Snow? How do you intend on keeping it cold? This is important to him, Fidget. We'll find a way. We just gotta get the water from a glacier. Like uh like like what's his name? Like Waterboy, Babu Boucher did it in Waterboy, where he had the ice from the glacier. And it was blessed or whatever, and it's always cold. We just gotta get some of that shit. But we have to get it in snow form, of course. Are you ready to leave, Dust? 
I think so, yes. We need to get back to the surface and find that manor Lady Tethys mentioned. Yes, I know of the place she spoke of. An old estate at the foot of the mountains called the Sorrowing Meadow. The Sorrowing Meadow? Is that somewhere between Blood Death Gulch and Endless Pain Hill? It was not always called that, Bishop. It was once a peaceful place. But even now, as we stand so far away from it, I can feel something nefarious emanating from its foundations. Well, that's great! Really, I'm excited. How about you, Dust? You excited? I'm just thrilled, Fidget. Come on, let's get back to the surface. I'm about as thrilled as about a thrilling person can be thrilled. Did you want the red stuff? Hello again, Flowhop. Hello, young man. We found some Yes, red moss is the one. Okay, she's the one that wanted oh, the red moss. Oh my, yes. These are lovely. They'll last me for quite a while. Here, why don't you stay for a while and have some soup? <gasps> soup! To be I like soup! Can I have had? some soup? I want some uh, soup. I appreciate the uh, offer, we are in a rush. Can we have some soup to go? So soup in a bottle, as it were? That's a great idea. All right. Yes, soup Here in a bottle. Know. What is this, Wind Enjoy Waker? Now. Grandma soup Thank in a bottle. You, Take care. Anyway, cool. We got another quest complete. Anyway, I gotta head back to the fucking village entrance so I can go back to the fucking thing and get the last sheep so we can be done with the sheep quest as well. Uh, let's get over here and finish this damn sheep quest. Yo, yo, sheepy, sheepy, sheepy. Not you, sheepies. There was a sheep back here, I'm pretty darn certain. And we couldn't get to it until we could slide, but now we can slide. So let's go back and get this damn sheepy, sheepy, sheepy. Hopefully I can remember where it is. I know it was over here somewhere. If it takes me too long, I'll cut, but I feel like it was over here. I don't remember. I might just cut to finding it, because I know, honestly, I don't want to show me fighting every single one of these goddamn enemies. Okay, so here's the sheepy sheep. Right here. There's a motherfucking key. And there's the last sheep. I knew where it was. I completely forgot it was literally right there. But hey, it's done. We've done it. We've got the sheep. Let's get the f back to the village and drop off the sheep sheeps. Wait, did you have another quest, old dude? Get them trolls, boy. This makes a good heat. Oh, that's right. He wanted some kind of like troll cans or some shit, which I didn't. I think I got one of them. Anyway, where's the sheep herder guy? We're done with that quest as well. Yo, yo, yo. We got all the sheep, son. You found your sheep, Gappy. They didn't seem too concerned about being lost. I honestly have no idea how you carry those things around. You don't want to know. Thank you, son. You're a good people. Here, have some wool from my flock. Trust me, this is prized stuff. You do be the judge of that. Son. Folks like you are always welcome here in Mud Park. Fair enough. All right, old Gappy, you're welcome, sir. Okay, I think we're done down here then. I've already been over here. Whatever was over there, I already grabbed. There was a sheep, I think. Anyway, all right. I think we're done with all the quests that we finished here. We still gotta get some kind of collectibles for the old guy over here, and I think that was it for the quest here. So, in the next episode of Let's Play Dust, an Elysian Tale, we will. Well, I, I think we can make it back to the surface, right? The surface was just right over here, I thought. Pretty sure. Let's see if that's the case. Go ahead and start heading back up here. Just get the hell out of here. Wait, is there something over here? Huh, it still says there's a treasure in this area. There was something over there, I remember. But, is there something else? I don't know. It's not really that big of a deal right now. Alright, in the next episode, like I said, we shall continue on our quest to do things. I might go back and do some other side quest stuff first. Depending on what we have. I gotta go back and do something over in the forest, right? Let's go find something. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, cutscene. Hold on. General Gaius, you asked for me? Your report, Commander. What news do you bring? Our scouts believe he is alive, General. But his actions are curious. Curious? How so? He ventured into the Siramon Caverns and saved a village of natives. As I understand it, his actions got the water flowing again. If what you tell me is true, Cassius would never... No. Cassius would never. Keep me informed of the situation, Commander. That is all. Hmm. When did you grow a heart, my friend? Most unlike you. 
Am I Cassius? Or are they referring to somebody else? Interesting question, I think. Alright, yeah. In the next episode, we'll continue on to doing something side quest related. Probably go to one of these areas. The Hidden Cove or the Ivydale Glen. We're going to go back to the forest. I mean, we're going to do side stuff. We're not going to the mountain or the sorrowing meadow yet. Uh, yeah. So I'll see you guys then. Peace!